Good people, welcome to Fiddlehead Fiddle Lessons. Let's learn the tune Florida Blues. I'm gonna play the entire thing, then break it down for you part by part, note by note. This great tune by Arthur Smith. Here we go. He's a little flat. Okay, so um, I broke this, this is a blues, so it's 12 bars. I'm breaking it down into uh, each part, and then we're gonna learn each bar. So that's how meticulous we'll get, and then we'll put it all together, okay? So, um, I just have to tell you something though before we get started. Warning, this may be fun. Okay. Now that we got the disclaimer out of the way, we can get started. So, first bar. I'm gonna start with E131. One. I'm just gonna play the whole bar uh, with finger diagrams. And now with more flow. All right, so it starts E131. Open E after that. Next three notes are all on A string, three, one, open. Let's put it all together again. So this is an important part. Let's take a moment and loop this part together. Three, four. Good. You could continue doing that on your own. I'm going to stop and continue, but it's a very good practice to really master the first bit of a tune for many reasons. It'll give you confidence going through the tune. It'll help you remember the tune. And often it's repeated. And, and so you've done work for later in the tune already. For instance, this first bar is pretty much the is exactly the second bar. So you now know two bars. So let's just do that twice in a row and then we'll move on to the third bar. And swing it a little. Do, 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 do. All right, let's move on to the third uh, bar of this tune. With more flow. So it starts D2, A, D2. And then, oh, and then back on D, open, low, two, one, open. Here's again. First we had. And then, add G2. And let's put all that together. Okay, moving on to the fourth bar of the tune. And with more flow. So it starts G, one, two. And then on D we go open one, two. And then add more to that. Open one, two, one, open two. I'll do that again. Open one, two, one, open two. Before that we had one, two on G. Let's put it all together. Try to sing it. Do, 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 do. And 
play it. Okay, cool. So I'm now going to put together the first four bars so you can see how they fit together. If any of this um, is any of the parts you're not sure of, just pause the video right now and practice it on your own. Here we go. First four bars. Great, let's move on. Uh, the next, the fifth bar, let's do that. With flow. D three, two, three. To A. And then on A, one, low, two, three, one. Before that. And then. Putting it together. All right. Let's move on to the sixth bar. with more flow. Open E to A3, one, three. There's that bit. And then A, D, three, two, three. So I like to think that in fiddle tunes, anything you need to practice is buried in there. And once, once you hit a part that's hard, you pause and just kind of just focus on that. So this might be a really hard part. So we can do something fun. We can make up an exercise from the tune. So take this bit and just loop it at first, add a variation. All right, now try to start instead of on E, on A. Now start it on D. This has become quite an involved exercise now. Now let's put them together into a series, like So you see, you can be pretty creative with how you practice this stuff. Another thing you can do would be to just maybe do the notes backwards. All right. So once you do that a bunch, you move back, then you kind of circle back into the tune. And here's our sixth bar again. If you practice this way, you're sure to get better at the tune. It may not happen instantly, probably won't happen instantly, but it will, it will eventually happen and you'll have fun doing it. So let's do the seventh bar of the tune. With flow. So it's gonna start um, basically like a D major scale. Open one, two, three, A. And then low two one open. Again. Okay, and moving on now to the eighth bar. All 
with flow. Starting A3, open E1. So we kind of go up and down. A3, open one, low two, one, open, A3. Just up and down, and then we're gonna add on another E1. All these tunes you could write a new tune with if you took a little part and just made something new. It's really fun. Um, that's why I don't know as many tunes as I should. I went to Ireland recently and uh, there's thousands and thousands of tunes because what I do is I always get distracted by I want to make a new melody. You don't need to know this to learn this lesson, but it's really true. There's like, there's like tunes buried in the tune, like future seed tunes in here. Anyway, that's another whole discussion, right? Let's get back to our song, Florida Blues by Arthur Smith, great fiddle player from a long time ago. Um, ninth bar. Uh, it's taking a long time. I mean, you know, quarters seems like, you know, four quarters, you're done, like 12 bars. Ninth bar. With flow. So on E, low two, three, low two, one. Then open one, open A three. Putting it together. All right, let's move on to the 10th bar. With flow. So that's a two, three, E, low two, one, and then, and then we have a, let me do that again. It's another good spot to practice because you got a two to low two on E, and then one, low two, one. I'd like to slur those two, three notes together. Actually, slur into the next note, which is open E. Adding A2. So it's whole bar 10. Bar 11. more flow. A3 open, low two one open. Then D3 two one. Closing with this. Let's break it down. And so that's open on D, open to A. Note that's a D major triad. And then A, two, three. All right, so a lot of separate parts. I'm now going to put the whole thing together. Again, you may want to practice each part a bunch on your own, pause the video and do that. But otherwise, I'm going to play it very slowly. Feel free to play along or just listen because listening is practice too. Here we go.
that's it. Thanks for hanging with this lesson. Hope it was fun for you. It was for me. I love this song. I love playing it. And uh, we'll see you next time on Fiddlehead Fiddle Lessons. So long. Go to fiddlehead.com for a progressive step-by-step -step course outline, color-coded tabs, play-along tracks, sheet music, and much more. Thanks for watching the video club. Excellent. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.